Hey guys, I'm Shaham Bhupe from Scar Studio. So in this video, we are going to start from where we left off in our previous video in finishing the head into creating his ears. If you're new here, make sure you watch the part one and two videos to catch up. And we might go a little faster than the previous videos because we'll be doing much of the same stuff we learned in the videos. So check it out and you can download the reference images I used to model this character in the link below. And uh, if you like to buy the fully rigged model, you can get it from my website, scalaglobal.com, link in the description, and uh, do some cool animations like this. So I have over 15 hours of footage to this series, and make sure you hit the bell button to get notified when I upload the next video. So uh, you can upload your progress in the Facebook group and have discussions, so link in the description for that. I start by selecting these three vertices and go to edge select mode with 2 and scale it down, extrude again with E and now I'm going to drag this edge back, select this, extrude it out, extrude out again, rotate and follow the reference image to get the shape of an ear, extrude, rotate, extrude rotate, extrude again, select the edge from the other side and F to create a new face. I feel like there's too many vertices so I might dissolve one edge, new X, dissolve edge and drag this down like that. Now I'm going to go to vertices select mode, select these words and uh, extrude them out like that and, and go to the front view, move them forward to the side and rotate with R, Z and place it on top of our reference image. Okay, it kind of looks good. Alt left click the inner vertices and extrude them in and move in. Might extrude again. And now I'm going to start adding our faces. Oh, before that, I'm going to have to move it to the middle. Okay, that looks good. Scare it in and select these four vertices and F create a face, select these two edges, these two edges, F, and here we might form a triangle, but it's okay. And there we go. And the edges look too harsh, so I might all select this edge and dissolve that edge as well. Okay, that looks good. Now I'm going to turn around, Alt, left click the, ed the edge and scale it down like that and maybe move it a bit. And also you can disable the mirror modifier so you can see inside. Now I'm going to select these words, pull them out a bit and um, select these, these move a bit, select this vertice and I'm trying to find a way to create a new face like that. And select these four vertices and F to create a new face. And new face again. Select four vertices. Sometimes you might accidentally select vertices from the inside, but just have a look. Pay attention to what's going on and F. So that word C didn't work there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to add an edge loop over here with control R add an edge loop and that triangle over there we created earlier, that'll be a card as well. So I'm going to select these four vertices and F these four vertices and F and now these four vertices F and we pretty much have our ear done. Now we are going to push and pull these vertices to get make it look kind of nice. 
I'm going to select these edges, pull them in towards the ear and pull them inside as well. Okay. So this is basically me, basically me just pushing and pulling vertices to get the shape that I want. And uh, yeah, so I'm going to just speed up a bit. And make sure you look at your model from every angle possible and uh, yeah, try to get it to shape of your reference image as well. And starting to look like what I want. So yeah, that's it for this tutorial guys. So hope you enjoyed it and so at this point we are mostly done with his head so in the next video we'll be creating his eyes and make sure you subscribe to get that so that's it for this video hope you all enjoyed it and uh, you can post your progress in the facebook group and come back for the next video i also have a video on my character modeling process here you can check it out or you can click here to watch the next video so make sure you hit the like button the subscribe button the bell button and the button button all the buttons before you go and see you in the next one we'll be out peace